Okay, wait. Welcome to Family Adventures Cancun. Uh, we're going on a, another little mini adventure today. We're going across to the island of Isla Mayores. We're going to be doing a little bit of exploring. We're going to be eating some Mexican food and maybe, maybe catch a spot of fishing. So uh, come along with us for the ride and uh, enjoy the video. Here we are, we're at Porto Jerez, just about to get the ferry across to Isla Mayores. So our hotel is situated just along the coast and around that bend, probably about seven or eight miles along the coast. So over in the distance just there, you can see the hotel strip of Cancun. certainly motoring along. And just 40 minutes later, here we are arriving in the port and on Isla Mayores. So we're just looking for somewhere to uh, see if we can't have a little bit of a cast and a bit of a fish and just so happens there's a restaurant and a bar here too. So we asked the owners of the uh, restaurant and the bar whose pier this was or pontoon and they said uh, it's sort of like a public one pontoon and we could fish from here so we thought we'd go to the end and give it a try. Well, we just went fishing off the end of uh, the jetty just there, and we didn't we didn't catch anything. But we saw a great big long blue fish with a long beak. Um, I think they call them blue wave runners here, but we, we didn't catch it. We took my sausage and spat it out. No like. <laughs> but uh, we're going to try somewhere else. But first, we're going to have a bit of bite to eat. <laughs> Just having a spot of lunch. Chicken tacos, lovely. Like, 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 so the shark in the little uh, 
compound in the water was a nursing shark and we went and had a look and got in the water with it but they wouldn't let us film it unless we gave him quite a serious amount of moolah so we declined and just just enjoyed ourselves looking at, at, at the shark and being with it. I believe that little sod just chose, stole some chicken straight off my plate. So back on the road then, continuing our journey around the island. So we're just going down here to check out the beach to see if it's worth having a go with the fishing rod. So here it's an uh, ancient reef which has formed the rock here. It shelves off fairly gently into the water and then drops off quite deep at the end. Yeah. Hook a fish mate, this is where you're going to hook it. What do you reckon? I don't think we'll cast far enough, will we? Hey? I don't think we'll be able to cast with our laws into that, will we? I think we'll cast into that wind. It's just, you can't really tell, but it's super windy. We just won't, we've got light gear, we won't be able to cast far enough out against the wind. It does look beautiful though. Goes up 
try and fish in the end and uh, decided to go back to the northern island and uh, find a nice beach and go for a paddle. Sorry, it's just too windy, so I've had to uh, voice over this again. But basically what I'm saying here is the hotel there, the Hotel Mir, used to be the only hotel on the island around year 2000, 2008, something like that, rather. Um, and now it's just overrun with tourists and fishing anywhere on the island is just really, really hard because every single inch of coastline is is just taken up with private property. Well, we thought it was time for churros. Guys, I'm just going to have some churros. Oh, look at that. That looks so good. Isn't that look good? Yes, yes. Have a good day. There you go, what do they taste like? Oh, it's got it. There you go. Show us your new t-shirt, Isaac. Look at that, is the leader is. Wow. We couldn't find any fish, but we found the next best thing. T-shirt with fish on it. <laughs> well, thanks for watching Family Adventures. If you like this video, please remember to click like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.